This video will walk you through how to install a Venton's hitch rack onto your vehicle. The Aventon hitch rack is a platform style rack and can fit just about any type and size of bike. If you have a step through frame, you will need to use an attachment piece in order to lock down your bike to the rack. This piece will attach to the seat tube and head tube of the bike and allow you to clamp the frame hook down onto it. To begin the assembly process, first insert the receiver tube into the hitch and align the holes of the trailer hitch with the holes of the receiver tube. Place the lock washer and the flat washer onto the hitch pin bolt before inserting it through the hitch and receiver tube. Next, securely tighten the hitch pin bolt, then install the lock head onto the end of the hitch pin and be sure to remove the key. Slide the receiver tube bracket onto the support beam and align the outer holes. Next, install the half inch bolt and washer. Tighten the nut and bolt securely. You can adjust tightness on the indicated nut using the provided wrench so that the support beam fits snug inside the folding bracket. Be careful not to over tighten or the fold up feature will not work properly. Pull the pins to release the posts. Now it's time to install the wheel trays. It's important to note that the two wheel trays with the red reflectors should face away from the vehicle. Install the wheel trays by loosening the knob and sliding them onto the wheel post. Start on the right side with the wheel tray that is closest to the vehicle first. Then install the wheel tray that is furthest from the vehicle with the red reflector. Repeat this process on the left side in the opposite order. Ensure that the tightening knobs remain oriented up on all four wheel trays. Take the small screws and secure one into the bottom holes on each of the posts. Tighten with a screwdriver. Position the longer frame hook on top of the square center post with the hook facing the vehicle. Tighten to secure it. Repeat this action for the short hook, except ensure it is facing outward away from the vehicle. Take your bike and line it up with the hitch rack. Loosen the knob on the wheel tray so that it can be slid in the proper position. Be sure to place the heaviest bike closest to the vehicle to ensure even weight distribution. The front and rear axle of the bike should align with the center of the wheel trays. To load the bike onto the rack, you first have to tilt the hitch rack downward. To do this, push straight down on the center post and lay it down towards you. Rotate the center post back to its vertical position and then slide the frame hook down so that it clamps onto the bike's top tube. Once it's securely in place, tighten the knob. Next, attach the Velcro strap to the wheel tray. It's important that the bike tire is cinched down and does not move within the wheel tray. Repeat these steps for the second bike. Once both bikes have been secured to the carrier, you can use the key to lock the top frame hook into place so that it cannot be loosened. And that's it! Now, you're ready to take your e-bikes on any adventure.